Hello everyone and welcome back to Let's Play Medieval 2 Total War. In the last one we had an epic siege of Antwerp, which can only be described as a Pyrrhic victory. And if you don't know what a Pyrrhic victory is, it's a victory in which you win ultimately, but you lose such a large amount of men that you couldn't win another such battle with the men remaining. It comes from some ancient empire i can't remember the exact details about it i vaguely know the details but it's some old uh, like in ancient greek times uh, some battle was fought where there was so few uh, of the victors left alive that uh, that it was called a ferric victory so yeah I, i'm not really sure where i was going with that it just sort of petered out <laughs> Right, so we've got a rebellion going on in Bruges, so I'm going to have to station a lot of men in there to quash that. Uh, Antwerp, um, merge all of them. I remember the uh, the shortcut this time. And I'm going to get some people from Reims to come up. Uh, let's see, I'll just use. Can you reach Bruges in a in it dear oh, hiccup a little bit there um no you can't can you what was the key to take off them bits no 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 there we go all right i wanted to take off them bits but you can't um so what i'll do is i'll just have you march to there you just can't make it in one turn but uh I can live with that. Khan as well, that's got a lot of people in that I really don't need. Um, it's got a lot of long bowmen, so I'll have them march upwards as well. Uh, Renz. Renz has just been sitting there for all this time, just sitting there doing nothing. Bordeaux's quite heavily defended for, for what it is. Oop, where are you? When you're just standing there doing nothing. I'll have you go to Toulouse. It's a good job he didn't go rebel on us. Um, right, billmen or shit. Armored swordsmen used are too expensive to really just have sitting there. Same with yeomanry, but if I remove the yeomanry, if it's sieged, that only leaves peasant archers. Ah, I don't think Bordeaux's under threat of being sieged, to be honest. I've got the Spanish to the south and the Portuguese. The Portuguese are neutral, the Spanish are allies. Um, the only way I could have Bordeaux sieged is if someone was to land a force on there, so I'm not too concerned about that. So I'm going to have you march up in uh, this direction. I'll have you march. So have you march to Khan. Hey, maybe not Khan. I'll have you march up here. Does really have to go that way? Does really have to do that? Is that the. That's not the quickest way. Is it? That's probably that's probably about the same. Right, I'll just have you. I'll just tell you to go to Bruges. That's shut up. Right, burn. What I might do is attack him. See, because I've got, I've got them two armies. Uh, let's have a look at his makeup. He's got hand gunners, but and have a look at him. How come he can have more than that amount of people? I can't. It won't let us. AI cheats, but he's got mortars, mortars, catapults, uh, a lot of crossbow militia and crossbowmen. He's got a lot of ranged units, not really that many fighting units. I'm going to do this. I'm sick of them. Let's see. Um, let's see. Could I not, could I not, before doing that, fold some of yous into that army? Uh, let's see. Longbowmen. Yeomanry, yews, 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 and fuck the spearmen, archers. Right. 
now the tide of battle should oh, wait you can fold into them there we go that'll do so there's say about 1800 men there versus about 1300 so I've got a good 500 more than them so basically another one of them um, your AI controlled don't fuck it up this time like you did last turn AI with the siege of Antwerp right, so I'm gambling a lot here I probably would inflict quite a lot of uh, damage on them even if I'm going to lose so that should render their army no longer a threat so all I can hope is that I don't lose too many men because that would be bad on my part so let's start the deployment I actually like this terrain got quite a good hill here uh, they're probably going to start off down there the only thing is I've got to watch out for their mortars their mortars could wreak havoc on my lines so let's see I'm gonna split me line into two I'm gonna have you go up here like that I'm gonna have you go hmm I could pull them all the way over here I've got quite a good incline there to defend from where are my reinforcements coming from? They're coming from back here, aren't they? Oh, should I do that? Should I split my lines? I don't know. Right, what I'm going to do is have my lines on this hill. And then I'm going to swing them around. So my lines are facing across like that. So they've got to charge up this hill to get at us. Uh, horsemen are going to have to take out their mortars and catapults. So I'm going to put my horse on the other flank, with maybe the exception of one lot of knights. You can be there as a defense, like a defensive force. Put yours up on this hill here, so you don't have to waste time running up it. And first things first, I'm going to have to get used to going loose before I forget, because if I don't tell them to get loose. The artillery is just going to kill everyone. Right, so you've got to stay close packed. You aren't going to get hit by mortars because you're going to be fast moving. You, right. Yous. Are all group one. Yous. Have you been dry? Right, so I need to get yous over here as well. Yous can go there. Get loose. Oh, there. There. Right there. That'll do. Um, what I'm actually going to do is have them behind them. So if any of them are out, I've got units to back them up. Same with yous. I'm going to put yous at the back as well. Have me lines two men deep. Which sounds vaguely sexual. I've just realised I've got no archers. Shit. Right, yous are going to be the very front because these are just mercs. So therefore I do not care for you. And your kind. Right. Uh, I've went and told this to become part of group 2. When I wanted to be its own group. Yous are part of group 1. Right. Um... I'm actually going to get yous out of that group as well. Because I'm not going to risk me general. You can sit on that hill. That means if anyone comes at them, they can charge down the hill and get a bit of a charge bonus. Alright, so horses. Yous are going to be up here. I'm going to have them charge down there and across. Like so. I could have them go through the woods, but they don't they're not hidden as they go through the woods so you are are you in wedge formation? I don't know I can't see you can now when you're not no you are and you I'll just have you stay like that right 
Uh, let's do this. Right. Use. Go there. Use. Go there. Use. Get there. Use. Go there. And I'll get used and march up. March up, march up. Use. I haven't been told to move. I'm going to get used to go there. Use. Go there. Where are they? Ah, sneaky. They've started off in the woods. Shit, I've just realised their reinforcements are coming in from that side, so I'm not really going to have a chance to attack their mortars. Let's see, which is the least important use. Sorry, use of the suicide mission. I'm going to pull them back over there. My reinforcements are coming in from down there, so hopefully they come across and plough into them. That would be nice if they did. Right, it looks like they're merging to become one big force. Nope. All I can hope is I'm out of range of their mortar. Captain Edgar. Yeah, they're emer they're merging to become one big force there. My AI is not going to do anything that clever though, so I'm probably going to have to uh, move in to help. I didn't want that to happen. Right. Use. Rotate it like that. Uh, and I want all of you. Let's see. You get back here. Right, so if I form me lines. You get there. You get there. You get there. Um. I've got no idea what I'm really doing here. Right. Oop, don't want to pause it. No. Oh. What do you use? Use a mailed knight. Get over there. Uh, right. What I'm going to do is send yous down to there. What are yous? Shit, they're moving. What are they doing? What are they? They look like they're knights, so I'm going to get my knights to move to intercept. So it looks like they're going to try and uh, attack the lines. They're just forming up. Uh, I'm going to have you charge in at them as well. Oop, that's some nice trees. Nat. I suppose with the amount of trees, I can't really go into much detail with them. No, stop fainting. That's what they're doing, they're fainting. Right, no, abandon the charge. I'm not getting sucked in. I refuse to get sucked in. They're militias there, though. They're malicious militia. I don't like that position that they've got there. They've got a nice position there. It's forested. Cavalry can't charge. They've got a lot of ranged units. Right, go for it. They're all yours. Nope, they're still fainting. Right, go for that militia. Let's see, what are they handgunners? You might get attacked by the hand. Well, you probably will get attacked by the handgunners. But if we can make them rout, that's 73 less people to care about. They're still fainting. So that's the first engagement. I'm actually going to quickly withdraw them because they're too close to the enemy's strong point. They're all just fucking walking in, right? I'm going to have to 
really just mass me forces and just push because they've got a nice nice strong point there the only thing is their cavalry is not going to be much use there either it looks like their cavalry is coming for me so get all the use and get used to march in as well see your mercenary spearmen and the good thing is their handguns aren't probably going to be any good here so I'm a bit nervous about this I'm not uh, I wish our AI was clever enough to not just go every unit attack that would be really nice of them but uh, unfortunately no and they were clever enough to merge their forces so um, it's like Hood can forest this where the allies and there the axis I suppose historically as well English were the allies and the Italians were part of the axis um, let's see use are just militia I use our mercenaries Um, and have you go there I have you just got wait you was all attacking them Att the militia right move in defeat seems certain for them I'm not sure what I don't know like I wouldn't say we're winning the battles only just started Um, I want you to go for the mounted sergeants the dismounted field knights are running years as well, so I need use to I need use and use. I want just one big stack of people ready to attack. Where's the rest of them? Use, I want use up here. Run. Let's see, I'm not gonna waste me knights on this with the hill. If the battle turns against us, they'll be forced to come out at us. If the battle goes my way, I won't need the knights in the first place. So, attack the handgunners. Yes, go for it. Wait, they're coming back at you. Get them. Surround them. I want you in on it. Just uh, them dismounted field knights are running. Because stupidly they've uh, all ran in, and like I said, the AI has decided the best course of action is just to get everyone and tell them to attack this hill. So let's see, are you mine? Yes, but you're knights, right? You, I'm gonna have you come around and into them. I haven't seen much of their catapult and mortar, which is probably good. I think all the forces are too intermingled to really, for them to really use mortars anyway, because it would inflict a lot of air casualties on themselves. Oh, yes, he's enemy. You want to watch yourself though. Enemy general has fallen, Angelo de Dalmatia. They're routing, so I'm not going to be bothered about them. But then mounted sergeants are coming back into the fight. Let's see, I want to move yous up here. They're, they're now routing them like cavalry. So I'm going to swing yous around. They're routing, so I'm not going to worry about them. So I'm going to move them up to here. So I'm doing a pincer movement, I've got them pushing there, and I've got them pushing there. Well, I've got to hope it wait, they have. So I'm going to send a, a detachment to go and deal with them. The crossbowmen will have very little in terms of morale, so just attacking them will probably uh, be enough to rout them. It was chase after the handgunners. I don't want to really push them now too far though. Yo's, where's everyone else? Get up! 
Don't be girls, get up. I would say we've definitely got this. A lot of them are routing. So I'm going to get me cavalry to go there. My armored swordsmen are routing. I take it that's them. Yep. Even though there's 38 of yours. Chances are you'll get your shit back together. Who's still left for them? Who's still in the fight? Them. Peasant crossbowmen. It looks like they're just fleeing the field. Trying to uh, get out as fast as possible. With as many men alive as possible. So I'm going to try and see to it that not everyone makes it. I think that's all that's left to do. Is just wait for them to all reach the border. Behold how our cowardly foe runs. It's time to press the attack. Yep, that's uh That's this battle well and truly over. I'm gonna have you go for them. on them uh, right, there's some handgunners there and also someone else as well some peasant crossbowmen I'm basically just trying to inflict as many casualties as I can on the routing army Right, there's more of them than there are them, so I want you to get on them. They're the last ones in the in in the fight. So once they go this down, I think we absolutely battle. wiped the floor with them. Look at that. That, that's really good. We came out of that fight a lot, lot stronger than them. They might have had a fair few units route, but we've got a lot more still left. Whoo, 6,000 just for them. But it's Venice. I know Venice is rich, so they'd probably pay it. So I'm going to execute them. And I'd rather weaken the Venetians than... Uh, get money off them. Let's see if I merge use and merge use. Uh, you've now got two free spaces so I'm gonna put them in there. And has Burn got any ranged units? Yes they do. Right. I managed to wipe the floor with the Venetians there which I'm pretty pleased about. Um, so yeah. Let's have a look at Mars here. Can I merge any units there? No. Uh, so I think that's going to be it for this episode. So I shall see you in the next episode where hopefully we continue fighting the Danish and just putting off the Venetians. I'm not actually actively engaging the, the Venetians. I'm not going to be sieging Milan or anything just yet. Plus Milan has a lot of units garrisoned in it. So... Uh, ooh, I didn't even realise that uh, that he was in Genoa. I had a spy there. John of Buckingham. There's a 48% chance that he would open the gate. Right. Um, ooh, Venice have got a place there as well. I didn't know that either. So, yep, yeah, that's it for this episode. I hope to see you in the next one. Until then, farewell. <laughs>